Next question. Um, I do want to make sure that I get as many different people who have been asking questions. So I saw that, like, I'm just going to try to make sure that at least if everyone gets a chance to answer, ask one question that we can try to get to that. Um, so I'm going to move down a little bit. If I'm currently in my first year at university in Tanzania, is it necessary to include my coursework during the application process? Not an international student so I will want to say that's kind of a question I feel like you should um, ask the university and explain the situation like hey I'm an international student on my first year at Blank University do you require me to send in the courses that I've taken because also money wise some of these so some schools have an international program so they actually do like a broad study abroad program so maybe for going to this school that has a study abroad program you're able to transfer these credits for when you want to come to the states to go to that school and so it kind of saves you time and kind of money so you're not having to repeat the class that you already took your first year in you know your university so that specific question being that none of us one went to university in um, a different country. Um, I will want to say that specific question, email the college, email the admissions, whatever, search up the email for that college that you're looking at and ask them, what do they require? Um, what information do they require? Do they require what you're asking about? So the courses and stuff like that, because that is for them to know. And I also don't want to tell you something and then the university may be like, no, we don't need it. Or maybe they do need it. So Go and ask them, but I want to say I probably do think that they would because even now high school, they ask for our high school courses um, and I did dual enrollment. So they did even ask for my dual enrollment classes that I took at my at my community college. So, yeah, just email the college specifically and ask them just so you can get a definite answer. Yeah, definitely echoing that, emailing them will be the best one because some colleges definitely vary for that. All right. And then moving on, when do you recommend that you start applying for colleges? Is it after you get your high school grades or before, like uh, mid 12th grade? Um, OK, so I was already answering this question. Um, for me, I started doing it during the summertime. Well, sorry if you hear my dad in the background, but um, I was I started applying during the summertime while I already had certain grades because when you're when you're um they don't ask for your um fall transcripts for your twelfth twelfth grade year until after the first semester is done so like say you get um say you get put if you do an early action and you get moved to the regular decision they'll ask for your fall grades after after you um after your fall grades are already submitted. But for me, during the summertime, you they ask for your um your grades from your past, from like eighth grade to eleventh grade, and then when you put in your twelfth grade grades, you can just say it's in progress. And then once once your once your full year is over, and you commit to a school, then they'll ask for your like your full grade full grades from twelfth grade. They'll ask for that transcript at the end. But for me, I'd say apply during the summertime so you can like start getting a head a head start. And then, then you, once you start getting like your 12th grade grades, then you start adding them into your college application process. But at the very end, the, your high school will send your full transcript, like your full year transcript to your college at the very end. So they'll still get all your 12th grade um, grades. They'll get your whole year at the very end, either way. So you can start, um, it also depends on where you wanna like submit your, if you wanna do like um, um, early decision, early action or regular decision, it all depends on that. So for me, I did early action. So I had to get a really head start because my deadline was in November. It wasn't in like March or whatever. It was in November. So I had to get a really head start. So it really depends on where you want to like submit your application. If you want to do early decision, you have an earlier deadline. If you want to do early action, you have a little later, but still early deadline. And then regular decision, you have like the longest deadline you have. So it really just depends on where you want to submit your application. So I would say if you want to do early action or a regular or early decision, do it during the summertime. That's how, that's like the longest you can have to do your application process. But if you want to do regular decision, I say in the middle of your 12th grade year or even in the summertime as well, to, if you want to get like an early, early head start. Mm -hmm.